up everyone welcome back to the channel and as you can see today i am drawing lino from the thundercats lino uh the thundercats one of my favorite it's it's a toss-up it's always a toss-up between thundercats or he-man my favorite cartoon growing up saturday morning cartoons this is the first drawing of this new kind of series i'm thinking about doing on my channel uh saturday morning tunes where i draw um some cool Saturday morning cartoons that I grew up on somewhat and they're not all going to be Saturday morning cartoons some of them will be like the ones that came on during the week or whatever and um <clears throat> yeah so this is a yeah, let's get into it Lino right here uh funny story uh Thundercats like I said one of my favorites and let's see drop the opacity on this a little bit um yeah one of my favorites growing up, and so much so that uh, one time I uh, got a little scuffle. Not even a scuffle. It was like, I don't remember what happened. I think I was in third, fourth grade, something like that, waiting at the bus stop. Um, and this, some kids started, like, doing something to me. I don't know if they were, like, pushing me or I can't remember what started the, uh, the fight. And it wasn't even a fight, as I'll get to in a minute. But make sure I got my right brush here. But yeah, so they started doing something to me, right? And uh, the first thing, the first thing that came to mind was Thundercats. So like they were pushing me. I think someone hit me. I can't remember. And all of a sudden, like I jumped back at them, like trying to slash them, not punch them, trying to slash them, like 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 if I had claws and uh I let out this kind of growl and all of a sudden everyone stopped there were probably I don't know what 10 kids waiting for the bus everyone stopped and they were like kind of just staring at me and I was starting to cry because I was like what what happened why are you guys picking on me or whatever but everyone stopped and kind of just looked at me and then the guys they were like picking on me they just started laughing, and then everyone started laughing. And now I was just like, oh, my God, did I just growl out loud as I tried to fight back against some bullies? Yes, I did. I did. I growled out loud. And, uh, yeah, so that is my uh, very embarrassing Thundercat story. Because it stuck with me that year. Like I said, I don't remember if it was third grade, fourth grade. I don't think it was fourth grade. It was either second grade or third grade. And uh, that year, every time I saw those kids who were, like, bullying me at the bus stop, they'd come up to me, and I'd get, like, all nervous, tense up, and all of a sudden, they just go, rawr, and start. Uh, it's funny now, thinking back on it, but at the time, I was completely embarrassed. I was like, oh, my God, I thought I was a Thundercat. I thought I was going to attack these guys and something. That's the... Uh, that's my imagination right there. So yeah, anyways. So Lino was my uh, favorite, obviously, you know, you, I think everyone, some, almost everyone's favorite was Lino, but yeah, he was my favorite growing up. Very cool idea of like, you know, these group of survivors and they have this one kid who's like, he's really just a kid, but now his body grew up. I thought that was a very interesting idea. And then, uh, let's see, who was, who was my second favorite? Probably, probably Tigra, I think his name was. Tigra. The twins were all right. They were kind of cool. I like the little pet they had, Snarf. That, that, that thing was cool. Panthro, Chitara. Yeah, all these guys were awesome. Oh, man, I'm just remembering another story, too. So, yeah, Thundercats. I had the toys. And I was so happy I got Lino. And I've always wanted to get him again. Well, actually, I have some old ones I found at some different um, toy conventions. But, yeah, when I, I remember another, it's probably the same year but for the bullying story. But uh, got the toy, super excited about it. And so what do I do? I take it to school for show and tell. And what happens? Uh, some kid that I 
used to be friends with. He has to, you know, play with it for for recess. Now, I was already told you the uh, bully story, and uh, I wasn't picked on a whole lot. I kind of made friends with everyone, and actually, uh, the people who did uh, who did fight with me, you know, uh, for that one. Thundercat inter- inter- interaction. They, uh, I actually became not not close friends, but friends with them later on. And other, and as I grew older, because I'd be I'm friends with pretty much everyone, kind of relate to everybody. But anyways, uh, the friend I lent my toy to during recess, uh, not so much. He he got picked on a lot. I think he had some type of issues too. He has he had some type of issues. Looking back on it. But yeah, those guys who did that to me did kind of did the same thing to him. Only he had my toy, and uh, yeah, so he takes it. I go off play basketball or something, and then next thing I know, he comes back, and the toy is completely demolished. Yep, they did something. They were teasing him, did something to him, and uh, yeah, so. That was the end of that toy. I was super bummed out. My favorite toy. And it was no more after that. What you gonna do, right? Like I said, since uh, these all these toys have a nostalgia factor now and everything, they're, they're kind of out there in the world now and you can get them. So I think I have, I have one of the newer ones I love. Oh, let me, I'll get to that story in just a second, but that new, newer Thundercats cartoon, that was pretty awesome. So I have the, that toy there, um, and I got, I got a older version of Lino, but it's just the toy itself. I don't have the gauntlet, I don't have the sword, which is a bummer, but it is what it is, I guess. But yeah, going back to that newer, I really like that newer version of uh, Thundercats, where it's like the animation was all updated. I want to say it was from the early 2000s. That was pretty awesome. So yeah, so there's that. So I was going to try to do this thing whole uh, straight through, um, you know, recording on StreamYard and just post it. But uh, yeah, uh, after my little two stories, I <laughs> after those little two stories, I didn't really have much else to say, so I just keep going. Uh, so yeah, this is going to be a little bit of a time lapse, and I think I'm going to end this here. I could probably add some more stuff, maybe a background, add some shadows to Lino, but yeah, I'm going to call it a day with there, with Lino right there. Uh, yeah, if you so you've enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe. Uh, let me know down below in the comments below if you enjoyed Thundercats, He-Man, Transformers, any of those 80s Saturday morning cartoons, or which one was your favorite. Um, and I will see you in the next video. Thanks.